Yo, what's going on everybody? Devin up here in the back and we back with the comparison video. We got the AirPods versus the Samsung Live, Buzz, Beans, whatever you guys call it and let's get into it. Let's get into the design. Hands down, who you think won this? Come on now. What y'all think? Simple, the beans. Come on now, are you serious? Come on now, let's look at the design. This is clearly like the better design right here. Like, look at this. Does this remind you of something versus this? Like, what does this look like to you? What does this look like to you? Like, come on now. All right, now this. What does this look like? Come on now. The design alone generated most of the sales. I mean, when you seen the design, you was like, I have to get this. And when I seen the design, I was like, bro, I need beans. Like, I just love beans. Like, like I eat them, you know, and I can put them in my ear now. It's like, come on now. It's like, I need those beans. Sample the design. Hands down the beans, one that one. All right, next we're gonna get into battery life. Beans, you got six hours of battery life with noise cancellation on, eight hours with noise cancellation off. The total charge with the charging case, you have 29 hours. AirPods, 4.5 with noise cancellation on, and with noise cancellation off, you got five hours. And with the charging case, you got 24 hours. So who's the winner in this? Sample. But I do want to say with the beans, there's a little bit of a controversy. You see my last video where I put the beans in the charging case, I closed them, and the song was still connected to my beans while it was in the charging case. So there could have been a little bit of drainage and hopefully that was just a, a little small mistake or there was an issue where an update in the future will fix that. So, all right, so let's talk about the comfort level. The comfort is gonna be a tie because it's definitely your own opinion. It feels like nothing is in my ear right here. At the same time, I can kind of feel it falling out. So it's good that I don't really feel nothing in my ear right here, but it's not really good for my ear. But if it was better for my ear, I can definitely give the winner to, to the buds. Now with this, you can definitely feel something stuck in your ear. Because of the buzz part right here, you can definitely feel that something's in your ear, but it, it doesn't feel uncomfortable. So I, like I said, I have to give it a tie. And also this stays in my ear a lot better for me. For other people, they can't even use these AirPods. But for me personally, that's why I said, it's not really a win or lose kind of thing. It's more of a comfort thing and what can you use and what you can't you use. But all right, so next is voice assistance. Um, I've used both. And I have to give the winner to the Beans because both of voice assistants is good, Siri and Bixby or Alexa, whichever you call it. Um, they're both great, of course. They're gonna pick your voice up. I have to give it to the Beans because do way more than Siri does. And that's a fact, like, come on now. Like, I'm an Apple person, you guys know this, but Alexa do way more than Siri does for their users. And that's simple, like, that's a fact. So that's why I give it to the beans Killing because spray. of that reason. And also, you can basically Alexa just do way more things while you have the buzz in your ear versus Siri. Siri would get smart with you. Hey, Siri. I'm listening. <coughs> Cover your damn mouth when you cough. I'm not trying to catch Man, that Man, you can't even catch the coronavirus, bro. You a phone, you bro. You know what the fuck I can catch. Are you an iPhone? Nah, I just shut the up. I need direction somewhere. Directions I'm giving you is to the hospital for that dry ass cough. Makes me be like, all right, you got it. I'm, I'm whatever you call me. All right, next is audio control. Um, hands down, I gotta give it to the beans. The beans is very sensitive. Uh, if you touch it, it's gonna cut the whole music off. And this, it's sensitive. It's very sensitive to the touch. 
And I've had these AirPods for a while and some people had the AirPods for a while. Don't even use the touch controls. They just pull them in and pull them out. That's all they do. You don't really see someone like actually using the, the touch features versus a Samsung. You just boop, pause everything or you know, actually use the touch sensitive features. So hands down, I gotta give it to the beans for that reason. I mean, come on now, very sensitive. Next is the customization options, hands down. Again, I gotta give it to the beans. All right, come on now. <sighs> really? Apple need to step up, man, because I was just bashing the beans in my last video. But man, I'm just going through this list and it's like, I don't know, the beans looking kind of good right now. But um, customizations, come on now. Like they have their, they literally have their own app to customize it and change whatever audio you want to, boost the audio, treble, it's an equalizer. They can just, change the settings within the options and Apple is just basic. What do you want the left and right ear about to do? <laughs> Pause, play, next, make a call. Basic options. Come on Apple. You need to do better man. Alright next is noise cancellation. Come on now, is this even a choice? AirPods bro, like come on now. Connectivity range, I, I gotta give it to the AirPods again. Um, I can go outside, walk my dog, I can go to, you know, if I just go to the store, grocery store, whatever, still connected, it's, it's not giving up, it's, 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 it's still good. Beans, if I just close the door behind me, it's done, shutting down everything, the whole phone shutting down, the battery's done, it's just, it's cutting off everything. The Beans need to kind of step up their connectivity range because they don't really go that far versus the AirPod Pros. So, clear winner, AirPods. All right, lastly, let's get into the final verdict and the price. All right, let's get with the price. Beans, 170 versus the AirPod Pros. Two, let's get into the features of both. So the Beans have fast charging, IPX2, heart throb mode, Bixby voice commands, touch control, sound equalizer, wireless charging, and it has a companion app for iOS and Android users. So that's a huge plus. Like I said, I have an iPhone and a Samsung Note 10. The fact that I can kind of do both, that's good. I mean, and it doesn't, the sound isn't that bad on both. The fact that I can tweak controls on my iPhone, that's a major plus. And also, again, what I said with the customization, like, come on, Apple, what's going on here, bro? Um, and lastly, three mics. Now for the AirPods, we got IPX4, transparent mode, Siri voice assistant, touch control, wireless charging, and three mics. And that's pretty much it. So by looking at these two, I mean, of course, the beans have more features. By looking at this, who won these feature tests? That's up to you. Next is the sound quality. Hands down AirPods, come on now. Like, I'm definitely jamming on the AirPods versus the beans. The beans, I gotta freaking shove them things way into my ear canal. No, but all jokes aside, I had to tweak up the bass for me to hear better quality music. Now, it does play great music, but compared to the AirPods, no way. Mm -mm. Gotta give it to the AirPods. AirPods have a better luxury sound, better music. It picks up, it picks up uh, music and sound better than the beans do. Again, like I said, I really like the Buds Plus versus the beans, and I really still think when it comes to sound quality, the Buzz Plus is the best that it beats pros and the Buzz Live, but that's just my opinion. And lastly, it's call quality. Hands down, AirPods. I made a few calls with the Buzz Live and people could barely hear me on the other side. And also I had to turn my phone up so I can actually hear the people on that end. Once the update comes out for it, it's gonna be better. But for right now, Buzz just need to do better, man. Samsung need to step their game up because honestly, you should have just took the software you had from the Buzz Plus and just Put it on here and just update. I mean, I don't know. Maybe they wanted a whole new thing. But with all these going on this winter, you see the buzz wins and you see the pause wins. And it's a clear winner. The AirPods win. Like, come on now. The AirPods is the freaking best. Like, you serious? The AirPods is the best. Come on now. <laughs> you fool. <laughs> <laughs> all right guys thanks for watching um it was fun i hope you guys learned something today you know it's all fun it's all entertainment i like both buds live and beans but again i really think the best one again is the buzz plus 
If you guys watched my last video, I was doing a giveaway on three winners. It's still good until uh, on the 21st, I'm looking for a winner. So all you guys gotta do is just comment below, subscribe and comment, that's all. Subscribe and comment, that's all you gotta do. You can like the video if you want to, I really appreciate that. Uh, that do me a favor, but just subscribe, comment. That's all you gotta do to be a winner. Thanks you guys for watching my video. This is Devin Up, throw them threes up for your boy. And um, I appreciate it. You guys be safe out here. I appreciate you guys watching my video, seriously. And I'm out.